video, I'll show you how to create presentations using ChatGPT inside Google Slides. So there are multiple locations as a developer, you might need to create a tech talk, you might need to do a tech talk. And in that particular case, if you're going to create a presentation from scratch, it can take a lot of time. So in that, if you are trying to use an AI to help you with that, if you go through the process of using a chat GPT, you have to do a lot of copy paste. But there is an add-on called magicslides.app, which can help you do that very easily. I'll keep this video very short, so make sure to watch till the end. So the first thing is, it has two different features. The first one is where you can provide a text, a raw text. Let's say you have a lot of uh, raw text and you want to provide that and let the AI create a presentation out of that. For that, you can just provide a lot of text, as you can see in the video, paste that there and hit generate, and it will generate the presentation. Once you're done with that, you'll have a beautiful presentation done for you, as you can see over here. Now. There is a second option as well where you can just provide a topic. So let's say I provide a topic of particular SQL or something, a concept which I want to explain or talk about. I can just write it down and click, click generate and it will write a presentation about it. So let's give it a trial, you know, like just click on install to get started. And then I'll click install. I have already installed. So I'm just going to visit slide.new. Basically, you can create any, uh, you can open any Google slide and it will be available in the extensions tab. So I'll close this go to extension click open and let's say i want to create a tech talk about sql what is sql that's the presentation or tech talk i'm talking about so i'm just going to click replace there's not any presentations but anyhow it will also add images for each slide so now i'm just going to click on generate and i'll be right back in just a few seconds okay so as you can see the presentation is created and let's see how it worked out so what is SQL? It explained all these terms. It went into the SQL syntax. It talked about creating a database. It talked about querying the database. And it, talk, it talked about updating the data, joining tables, use case. It talked about the conclusion and the resources. Of course, you can make changes to this however you want. Not every image is perfect. You can actually replace image. You can search for the web. So for example, I want this to be more of like a developer. So I'll just search for code and I can choose any of these images. For example, I just can select this one and click on replace. This way I can just change these images according to how I want. And uh, you can even change the colors, font, however you want. But you have a basic structure done within a few seconds. So, uh, Give this a try and I'll see you in the next one.